are crawling to this old house today. Hopefully we'll find something good. I came here about four days ago and I found a brass a plate off old dresser and some other odds and ends. A little lead thing. I don't know what it is. Could be a flattened musket ball and a tag with a guy's name on it. So hopefully today when I crawl up under here we will find some awesome relics. Right now I'm raking out all the debris and the glass and the stuff that's going to really cut me open. And I'm going to crawl up under there with my detector in a minute. I got my light. Special handy dandy light. I'm just going to set it under there and light the place up. And I'll get my AT Pro and me and Abby will get up under here and see if we can find some relics. So I'm hoping it'll be a great day. Let's go get them. A lot of dust in here. I'm wearing a dust mask. I mean, look at the dust. It's just terrible. You can see it, though. I'm raking these leaves out because there's too many in here and we can't get down to the dirt. The dirt's where all the relics are. I doubt it's on top of the leaves. It could be a snake in all this. Well, I don't know. I haven't found much under here. A lot of trash. I don't know if you can see. I just lifted up this tin roof and under it I found a mason jar lid. It's funny how stuff gets under the house. Old house for sure. There's old stone foundation. Ugh. Pretty cool. Look at that. I think they got a little bit of termite damage. I wouldn't say too much though. There's some termite tubes there. I just found this brick. It beeps with a detector. It's kind of weird. Let's have some iron in it. Huh. It's cool. I'll throw it out there. Abby's got a signal over here. Let's crawl over there and see if we can check it out. Look, there's a mason jar. Lid piece right there. Porcelain piece. Just eyeballed it. Ain't no telling. There's probably some clay marbles under here. Let's look with the light real quick. I don't see anything. Ah. Low clearance. There's some tin foil. Oh. Yeah. What'd you get? I got a chain. Oh man, yeah, iron chain. Uh-huh. Huh, somebody threw that up under here, didn't they? Yeah. Let's go find some more. Here's a really good place to hide old coins or hide your money. On this little ledge here up under the house. They can just take their silver dollars and lay them up on here. That's what I'd do anyway. Nobody would think to look up under the house kinds of hiding places up under here. Really cool. I got a good signal here, showing up in the 40s. Very shallow, probably trash, but you never know. Turn this pro pointer on. Didn't bring my shovel up under here this time. Had to take my pouch off, it was getting in my way. It's a little clock key wander or something, I don't know. I found them before. Check that out. I don't know if you can see it. There it is. Keeps falling out my hands. It's a little doodab. But hey, it's something. So, let's go find some more. Recheck the hole. Make sure that was it. Yep, that was it. Uh, uh, there's some boards. Old boards. Got nails in them. See if I can get a place in my legs. Alright. This is lots of fun. You gotta love detecting under a house. Ain't nothing better to do. Nobody wants to go out and dig the yard, do they? That's too easy. Alright. Check this out. I don't know if you see it. Look at that. 
Something crawled up under here and died. Ah. Probably a dog or something. I don't know what that is. Huh. Never know what you're going to find under a house. pretty old it's got wood pegs in it I mean they did that a long time ago Ugh. it's a pretty low clearance on this side anyway a little dusty under there just a little bit <laughs> Woo. man that was fun I'm gonna sift out some dirt from inside the house now I got my screen set up over here Uh, see the material on the floor, how it's really like dusty and all kinds of stuff mixed in with it. We're going to put this in the sifting screen and see if there's any buttons or coins in there. Right. Into the screen she goes! Like a dust storm. Let's see what we got in here. Bound to have something. There's a bunch of glass. Old lids. Oh, there's my pocket knife. That is unbelievable. I lost my pocket knife in this house site a couple years ago. And I never could find it. There was so much dirt on the floor and leaves. <laughs> That's funny. I only found it. Don't flip back as much. But, hey, surprised nobody found that thing. It's a little rusty. That's cool. That's the best find of the day so far. Wow. Let's see what else is in here. There's a lot of glass in here. To sift it up. Oh, I seen a button. There it is. Little button. Ain't that cute? All right. Put that in the pocket. Let's sift it out some more. All right. At least we found my pocket knife. Been looking for that thing for about two years now. Unbelievable. Woo! Well, I guess we might detect around the house a little bit now. We're out here digging in the barn now, the old barn foundation. And Abby just found this really cool object here. Not sure if y'all can see it. It's some type of cast iron thing off something. And it has a patent date of September 11th, 1883. So that's that's pretty old. It says A dot T bar pat. And then I also found on top of the ground in the leaves. This right here. Now this used to be the barn, so all this stuff was inside the barn or the shed. And I'm not sure what this is here. It's in the ground, I'm trying to get it out. So that's cool. I guess we'll keep this and take it home and see what I don't it know is. What this is? I think I may have found one before. Some type of huge metal thing with a chain on the end. That's weird. Put that in the pile. What do you got? You got some iron over here. Oh, I can't get it out. Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff in here. Yeah. We're back in the kitchen now, uh, doing some sifting. And Abby found a couple porcelain buttons on the floor. And so I started taking the dirt and throwing it in the sifting screen. And I just found a button. Might be something on it. Oh, man. Look at that. It's got like a flower design on it. That's really cool. 
or some type of design, not flowers, but that's nice. Old metal button, it's brass. Might be more on the screen too.